Yo, what is up guys? Today we're gonna be playing some twos games with the brand new Mudcat car from the Rocket Pass. This is from the 70th tier of the Rocket Pass, so the very last thing you unlock in the Rocket Pass. Um, and it looks really nice. On the side, I pointed this out in the last video, it says RLCS Rumble. I don't know what that'll mean in terms of this RLCS season. Maybe there'll be some Rumble kind of implementation throughout the season some mini rumble tournament maybe there's gonna be mid and mayhem like there wasn't like season two season three but regardless i'm looking forward to using this car and we'll get into the games and see how i like it all right for the first game of the video we're playing against donut king and underestimated and we have koozie on our team i think is how you say it probably looks pretty nice actually first time I'm using this already feels pretty nice feels pretty similar to octane normally that's the first thing i could sell with like an octane hitbox car that definitely does feel really similar to Octane, right off the bat. Just like how it turns and stuff. Because apparently, if a car does have the same hitbox, the turning radius and stuff will be the same as well. And you can definitely tell. Let my teammate go for this next. Nice. Just gonna wait here. He's probably gonna be up first. I can go for a shot. If that's any kind of high hit on target, it doesn't really matter. We're gonna probably get a touch on that regardless. Cause he's last back for a bit here. Good patience from him. I'm gonna flip back, get some pads on my way. I'm gonna have to help out here. Okay, it's fine. I'm just hit it forward. You make it secure it if he wants to, but it should be in regardless. I had to wait for the shot, because he was up first forward and I still was too far back to actually get in the way of it, but he ended up double committing pretty badly for that. So it just led to a free goal. But so far, our car feels pretty nice. No complaints as of yet. But I've only played a minute with it so far. Not quite enough to give my. Uh, proper thoughts on it is there a boost here good cut out for my teammate try to just bang that with no boost and we did good pass from him though left us a lot of space to work with challenged the, the midfield guy really well because he would have had a shot on goal if he didn't get there first gonna wait Play patient for the flick let this play this downfield he was trying to bump me so Better than getting bump, bumped to giving the ball away for free. At least it makes it somewhat difficult in a situation like that for them to deal with how the ball is coming at them. We got a challenge for him. Kept possession as well. A challenge back for my teammate. Maybe one more. Get a touch, maybe a follow. A try. I'll be patient here. Better watch the middle guy as well. Pass over to my teammate. Nice. I stay middle with my 50 boost. Oh wait, two on the wall again. These guys, they're not playing too great together. A lot of double commits coming through from them and it's making me and my teammates' lives much easier. They're just giving us a lot of opportunities to capitalize on. Just faking out the, the flick there. Go for another challenge. Teammates gonna be last back for a bit, but he should be okay. It's up pretty early for that. I'll challenge this first. Even if it gets over me, it's not too big of a deal. Just try to get out of the way of uh, the opponent. Because he was air dribble in that. This can be dangerous. It's pretty fun. I gotta wait for a shot here. There we go. Wait for the right opportunity to challenge that. Teammate can finish it off. Just to secure it. Why not? There we go. Again, a lot of our goals are just coming from them making mistakes and just. Committing too far. I probably thought he could have got it over me there. So I waited to the very last moment to challenge it, but I knew I could still get a touch on it at least. He may last back for a bit, but I can help him out. I'll be behind him, even if he gets flicked. Oh, try to see if I can get an absolute banger of a flick on that, but it's safe from them. There we go. Seven boost. One more. I'll probably have to leave that. Oh. A little bit of a mistake from him. I just played it patiently. And that's gonna be the game for the first one. But it felt it felt pretty good, honestly. No complaints. Like it felt very similar to the Octane. That's the thing for me, is like I don't think I'd ever switch off of the Octane because to me, even when a card does feel similar to it, there's no real reason for me to throw away the time and you know, like just the amount of gameplay I have with the Octane, it's just unmatched, right? So if a car like this feels very similar 
I made a switch to try to learn like a slightly different visual of how the ball will affect like being hit by my car. Because even though it is the same hitbox, there's still a slightly different visual on the front of the car and how hits are affected by that. Like it's kind of it's kind of weird to get a grasp of that. But you know, why would I throw away all the time with Octane for a car that has the exact same hitbox when I'm so used to Octane already? So I'm probably just always gonna stick with the Octane if I'm being honest with myself. But it is fun like switching it up, playing with a new car like this. And it is nice to know that if I ever did want to play with this car, I could use it and still be as good as I am with the Octane because it feels very similar in that sense. But yeah, let's get into the next one. See if we can keep it up. All right, for last game, we have Bon Joe on our team against Alex and Jake. Let's get into it. Oh, that was a big play. That was really aggressive for my teammate, but it was smart. That was a good kind of aggression. It was, it was not risky and ended up leading to a goal, so. Like worst case scenario, he gets beat in that situation, and I'll have the ball for free pretty much because they have to hit it around him. I'm gonna bang this on target. There we go. Caught him off guard. You probably didn't expect such a fast shot out of that. Yeah, the car feels super similar to the Octane. I would have shot the exact same way on the Octane. Oh my god. That felt really nice though. That was super smooth. Really nice dribbling play. Absolute banger there. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna call kick off so we don't both go. Yeah, honestly, no complaints at all so far with this car. Nothing I could say that I don't like about it. But that, again, probably because it's just so similar to the Octane. Only complaints I have about the Octane is that you randomly get like noodle hits. Like you'll come at the ball really fast and you'll just get like the weakest touch ever sometimes. It's rare, but it happens. There's just a certain part of the front of the Octane that's just a little bit broken, I feel like. Try to see if I can control this ball. See what we can do on the dribble here. Nice little fake action, there we go. He just flew way over me. I was never going to flick that ball. I was going to keep it right on that part of my car because it looks like I'm going to flick it. It's pretty dangerous. If he waits, I'd probably end up flicking it, but I play that strictly off how the opponent ends up playing it. Honestly, in this game so far, like I've been getting a lot more power hits, I feel like. And the front of the car feels a tad bit like... I can tell what's going to happen when I hit it with the front more than I could with the Octane. Just a little bit. It actually feels pretty nice in that sense. But again, it's very similar. That's the, that's the main difference I've noticed with those cars that have similar hitboxes or the same hitbox. Is that the main difference is how the front of the car, like the visual, actually impacts the ball. That's the one thing you'll notice the most. And this car feels nice in that sense so far. Like I said, it's only two games. I'd have to use a car like this way longer to actually give a really, really good review on it. But what I've seen so far, not bad at all. Uh, good interception for him. I would have probably had that. But regardless, normally it leads to a goal in a situation like that. I hope they stay. Oh, he left. Yeah, so far, I'm really enjoying the car. I actually just got a painted one right there. I'm gonna drop my heart off. Thank you, Alex. Appreciate you, bro. Thank you, thank you. All right. All right, guys, gonna be off for this one. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know down below what you think about the car, and I'll see you all in the next one. Love y'all. Peace.